Ghost Stars released this image of Tasha attending a funeral in handcuffs, but whose funeral is it? Is it Ghost's funeral or is it Grandma Estelle's funeral? I'm breaking it down for you and why I think it could be a mom's funeral instead of ghosts. Welcome back to MovieBot and let's talk the mystery funeral. So many of you know who were subscribed to me previously, I released this video about whether this could be Ghost Funeral, basically questioning who's in the casket. I won't go into whether I think Ghost is alive or not in this video, I'm still pretty much on the fence and I go into it in a lot more detail in my previous video so if you want to know more, click that video, I'll leave a link to it in the description and in the comment section down below. But now that Ghost Stars have released this image, it's got me thinking whether it's actually Grandma Estelle's funeral. Let's break it down why I think it could be Grandma Estelle's funeral and not Ghost's. So first things first, I've done research and Grandma Estelle is only going to be in 3 episodes in this first season of Book 3, quite low for someone who's going to be looking after Tariq and Yasmin. Even though she's not even a main character, you'd assume she'd be playing a bit part character throughout the series. You know we have scenes of her visiting Tasha in prison, looking after Tariq and Yaz. Like she did in the original series of Power, she wasn't a main character but she was always there in the background through to season 6. So her role in this first season is only going to last 3 episodes and then there's the question well if the feds have actually arrested Tasha for ghost murder and they believe that she's the one that shot him then the husband of ghost or not why is she being allowed to go to ghost's funeral if she's the one who supposedly murdered him this is why I don't think it's ghost's funeral and it could actually be grandma Estelle's funeral instead I mean it really just defies logic for someone to be released from prison to go to a funeral of a person they've been accused of murdering so this is why I genuinely believe it could be grandma Estelle's funeral the original trailer that we saw about a month or so ago threw us a bit of a red herring because they had a picture of ghost they were talking about ghost and then they showed us the clip of the funeral with Tariq and Yasmin standing over the coffin and it would make total sense for it to be ghost funeral but it also makes total sense to leave ghost storyline in the original power series but the interesting thing about this funeral is why is Rashad Tate one of the main men who's carrying the coffin I'm not sure if many of you have even seen this image I mean it looks like Tate unless I need a new pair of glasses so why would Tate be holding the casket of Grandma Estelle it could actually make sense for him to pay respect to ghost considering he was working so close with him but maybe he's holding grandma Estelle's casket as a sign of respect as the governor of New York and if it is grandma Estelle's funeral and not ghost could she have died from a natural cause or could she have been killed in a crossfire or been murdered by Monet's crew and could that actually set up Tasha vs Blige I don't think this is likely because they can set up Tasha vs Blige in so many other ways I think if it is grandma Estelle's then it's going to be a natural cause and damn now you just see how Yasmin has grown over the last few years just look at this picture here this is from the very first episode of power season 1 back in 2014 when it first aired and now 6 years later to this and I'm pretty sure it's the same character playing Yasmin as well and what's going to actually happen to Yasmin if it is Grandma Estelle's funeral and if she is killed off because Tariq can't look after Yasmin, go to college and make money hustling in the streets for Monet all at the same time and I think this is when they could potentially have Tasha released from prison when Grandma Estelle does die but if it is Grandma Estelle's funeral then shit not only did they give Ghost a shit ending but they didn't even give him a send off, wow. This is why I kind of remain on the fence about his death, either they're doing it on purpose to keep the audience's interest in the spin off series, to make it look like he'll return when he actually is dead or potentially leaving it open for him to actually return, you know for example if the ratings for book 2 aren't that great. But either way I think it's a real cop out for Ghost not giving him a proper send off. Some may argue differently considering all of his sins but he was a major character and one of the favourites along with Tommy and I personally think he deserved a better send off. Let me know what you guys think down in the comment section, do you think it's Ghost's funeral or Grandma Estelle's funeral? Let me know down in the comment section and if you have any other thoughts then let me know down below and if you haven't done so already make sure you smash the subscribe button, hit this video with a like before you leave as well. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you next time.